We have a great news for all astronomers. We are having a celestial visitor in few days and it may become as bright as Polaris the North Star. The celestial object could be visible to the naked eye in coming days as it makes its closest approach to the planet in its orbit around the sun. This is the Universe Factory and today we are talking about a newly found comet that has an estimated orbit of 400 years. Before we begin, if you haven't already, please subscribe to this channel and press the bell notification next to it. We regularly post amazing content about all the latest happenings in the world of astronomy. This way you don't have to worry about missing these uploads in future. Additionally, follow us on social media platforms, links to which have been mentioned below in the description. Do check out. The year 2023 started with a beautiful green comet decorating the night sky. Comet C-2022 E3ZTF had its closest approach to the sun or perihelion on 12th January at a distance of 166 million km almost a year after its discovery. It passed closer to the Earth on 1st February at a distance of 0.42 million km. The comet reached magnitude 5 and was visible with the naked eye under the moonless dark skies. Just in case if you missed, we had made a separate video on the comet, make sure to watch it here. Now another newly discovered comet is approaching the earth and everyone is getting their hopes high to observe it. C-2023 P1 Nishimura is a long period comet that was discovered by an amateur astronomer Hideo Nishimura on 12th August 2023, just last month. Other discoveries by Nishimura include C-1994 N1 Nakamura Nishimura Makholes, C-2021 O1 Nishimura. So this comet Nishimura has the orbital period of 433 years, meaning it likely last passed near Earth in the 17th century. So what is significant about this? Hideo Nishimura did not make the initial sighting with his own eyes, but rather he was able to discover an approaching new comet when it was already crossing the Earth's orbit before any automated survey saw it. It is quite an accomplishment. He discovered the comet in images he obtained using 200mm F3 telephoto lens mounted on a Canon EOS 6D on 12th August 2023 when the comet was 1 AU from the Sun. Looking at its orbit, Comet Nishimura is rapidly approaching the Earth and the Sun. The comet will make its closest approach to Earth on 12th September at a distance of 125.3 million km. And after just 5 days on 17th September, it will arrive at perihelion, its closest approach to the Sun at a distance of 33.66 million km. These values initially suggested that Comet Nishimura will brighten quickly in the days to come. On 23rd August, it has been reported that the comet's brightness had risen to magnitude 7.9, an increase of 10-fold since its discovery 11 days earlier. According to experts, Comet Nishimura could approach second magnitude in brightness when it is nearest to the Sun on 17th September. This brightness is equivalent to the Polaris North Star. If you want to observe this comet, you have to be the early bird. You need to wake up at least 2 hours before the sunrise and also you need to have a good pair of binoculars. Needless to say, the location should be with less to no light pollution. Having one of the space apps given in the description will help you to locate the comet easily in the night sky. But unfortunately, as the comet approaches the sun, it will be dropping lower and lower in the east-northeast sky with each passing morning. From 26th August till 4th September, the comet appeared to be travelling through the Cancer constellation. 5th September onwards, it brightened to up to 4th magnitude sitting in Leo constellation. By 9th September, it had been only about 10 degrees or one fist held at arm's length above the horizon as the twilight sky brightened. And by the morning of 12th September, though it might have brightened to third magnitude, it will be sitting just above the horizon and the combination of the twilight plus any low altitude haze will make it very difficult if not impossible to see. 
so that will likely be your last opportunity to see it. So long story short, it will be very difficult to observe. However, you could still get a chance to observe it on 17th September when it comes nearest to the sun according to some sources. It will be visible directly above the sun in the evening sky above the western horizon at around sunset time. But the glare of the sun could overwhelm any of the visibility of the comet, so hope for the best. Comet Nishimura is following a hyperbolic trajectory. That means after its perihelion, it will exit the solar system never to be seen again in our lifetime. Comet Nishimura may not be as spectacular as Neowise that decorated the sky three years ago or C-2022 E3ZTF that was observed during the start of this year. But there is another one that approaching the Earth that has potential to outshine the brightest stars in the night sky. So we may have to wait for it till the next year's October. So stay tuned for it as we are going to post more information about this upcoming comet. Thanks for watching. We hope that you found this video informative and amazing. Like and share this video with your friends and family and let them know that a visitor is coming from outer reaches of our solar system. Subscribe to the channel and press the bell icon to get notified for the latest uploads in the world of astronomy. Meanwhile, watch these amazing videos suggested here. We will be back with yet another super interesting video for you soon. Till then, keep looking up.